I'm Tom Lasney. I work here at Hohola Farms. Uh, we farm about 650 acres of small grains, corn, and soybeans, as well as hay. Started getting into small grains again here recently in the last couple years. I met Mark Shelley from Power Ag at a local fair, and uh, he got me started with uh, the Power Ag line going into this year for our small grains. My name is Mark Shelley with Power Ag. I work with Thomas Lasney to help develop a nutrient program. Tom uh, was growing two row barley and his big concern was uh, healthy plants and yield. So in, in this instance, we developed a program that included four Power Ag products, M Power, Sulfur Power, Boar Power, and PK Power. Um, some of the things I've noticed with the Power Ag products this year has been our standability uh, from the storms that we've had come through here. Very little damage I've noticed. And then also, With these very uh, dense root ball here, lots of roots, little hairs on there, uh, and the stalks are, are super thick, and the heads um, very pleasing. I, I'm excited to see what the outcome's gonna be uh, because these are exceptionally long heads. Uh, so I brought you over to this field here. This is a friend of mine's. Uh, he used a little bit different variety. It's a six row variety of barley uh, versus mine, which is a two row. Uh, but as you can tell, not as dense as what we had, and he used just straight commercial fertilizers uh, with a fungicide and insecticide as well. Uh, but as you can tell, with the use of, I believe, the Power Rag products, the denseness, the knitting, and the root system on mine is uh, superior to what he's got going on here. Um, and he didn't even notice the difference as well. I can't wait till after harvest here so I can sit back down with Mark. This fall, we have a grant for a trial for uh, some barley. Uh, five different varieties, so I'm looking forward to uh, getting recommendations of what we could do uh, going from planting this time right into next year's harvest. So during combining this year with the barley, uh, we've noticed a few things. Uh, one, exceptional density in the, in the crop. Uh, as we were going along, you could barely even see the ground. And seeing those numbers, uh, seeing over 100 bushel uh, to the acre numbers on the combine meter, that's something to say about Power Ag products. After we got done harvesting, uh, we were able to go back out and bale the straw up. And, and an amazing amount we got as well, 110 bales to the acre. I mean, we haven't seen windrows like that for baling straw. I mean, we had to slow down uh, almost a whole nother gear. Uh, we had actually uh, three machines going just trying to get it all off the field here. And uh, um, like I said, we had trailer loads that came off where usually we would have had wagon loads. Uh, and to have that kind of amount uh, is uh, pretty phenomenal for us. Uh, I've never had that kind of success before.